Hello everyone, welcome to an accessibility video for Slither.io. So we go into the settings. We have three choices. So let's go with the standard choice, which is joystick mode. And here we go. Play. So as you can see here, you start off with your joystick on the left and your speed up on the right. But if you see at the top here, you can change that. So put your joystick on the right, which is what I prefer. And you put your speed up on the left. Thank you. I love that. So, I'll just die quickly. Or I'll swap them around again to show you again. Joystick on the right. On the left, sorry. Speed up on the right. And you can click that little swap thing again to swap them around. So that's one choice you have. Well, in fact, that's two choices within the first control system. So if you find you've got more dexterity on one hand rather than the other, you can swap it around to suit. But I'm going to deliberately die so we can swap. How hard is it to deliberately die? Not very. Okay, so we're going to swap controls over now. We're going to look at classic mode. So let's play. So classic mode, you literally move your finger on the direction on the screen to where you want to go. And to speed up, you've got a double tap. Double tap and hold to speed up. So if you have got problems um, with the coordination, that double tap and hold can be a bit harder. Certainly I find it a little bit harder. But if you don't, and you've only got the use of one hand, but you don't find timing difficult, this might be a good choice for you. Oh, just missed me there. I do find speeding up in this this mode of controls slightly difficult for me. Because you've got a double tap and hold. There we go. Oh, and I crashed. So that's a good place to try our next set of controls the arrow mode i quite like this one because it's kind of a cross between the joystick mode and the touch screen mode if you like the classic mode you see you can have your you've got your speed up on a button here and instead of having to go the direction on the screen you can move about on a small area of the screen so your hands don't tend to get in the way you can see what you're doing i kind of like this and if i get a chance to show you you can switch the controls over so you're you can move about on a small portion of the screen to turn your character and speed up on the left So let me know if you found this video helpful guys, if you did, please give it a thumbs up. This is my first accessibility controls video. And I think really the, the people that made this game have done a really good job with their accessibility for the controls. There's a really good choice of options there for, to make the game more accessible to more people. So well done. And thanks for watching guys and I'll see you all again very soon. Bye for now.